you know, like uh, I talked to you guys a couple a couple days ago about not being ready to play against Rutgers. Um, so I think we did a great job of that. You know, our mindset was totally different, our togetherness, and um, it showed. So, you know, we stayed with it. Um, we actually grew up, grew up a lot today. Um, we showed that we can keep a lead. We usually um, let teams back into it. But I think we did a great job of that tonight. Um, like JT said, um, we weren't ready to play versus Rutgers. Uh, but I feel like um, we had a very good mindset uh, in practice leading up to this game. And um, it just carried over into the game. And uh, we were able to get some momentum going. And, uh, and we kept rolling. Mark, you had a couple of tough misses early in the game, but you stayed with it and ended up making, obviously, one of the biggest shots in the game there at the end, the three-pointer, just to get it back out to 10. Just to talk about what you're going through and just how you have to stay with it, I guess, when the times are tough. Um, I mean, when you're on the road, you expect things like that to happen. But I mean, you get a couple that rattle around, but you can't let it discourage you. And uh, just go to the next play. Uh, my teammates and coaches encourage me to keep shooting. And uh, I mean, they have a lot of confidence in me. So I feel like I should have a lot of confidence in myself. How how big of a win do you think this is for you guys? I mean, you, it's a it's a team ahead of you in the standings. Yeah, I mean that's that's huge. You know, um, we still breathing, we still alive. Um, you know, we're just keeping the streak going. We still have a lot of work to do. You know, going to uh, Nebraska at Nebraska is a tough environment. Um, you know, we can celebrate this one tonight, but tomorrow we gotta get back to work. Mark, you answer. Um, I mean, um, not so much the heat. I mean, we we wanted to come out and prove to ourselves that we could play well um, from the beginning, and uh, we got to a great start. And uh, I mean, it's always a, a sense of pride beating the team up north. Uh, obviously, you guys saw, thought Karras was going to play because he had played the other day. How much did that change, kind of what you saw, and how did Michigan look? As a um, result, I mean, we knew that, uh, you know, it was going to be a type of game where they shot a lot of threes. Um, you know, of course, having their primary scorer, um, you know, helped out a lot. But, you know, we still prepared. Um, I mean, he's one of my great friends, but he's still about one player on the team, you know. So we prepared like, like we did with any other team. Mark, you were um – Scoreless on Saturday against Rutgers, and coach pulled you out, and he was saying he needed to see more from you. Um, I know the shot wasn't falling, but it seemed like you made more of an effort to go get rebounds. You had a couple nice looks. I think you finished with five assists. Um, I guess maybe talk a little about how you bounced back from that Rutgers game, and if you did make an effort to maybe do more things if the shot wasn't falling for you. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I just can't depend on my, my jump shooting. Uh, I mean, I can get my teammates into the game, like you said, with assists and uh, rebounding. When we, we out-rebound teams, we have a better chance of winning. Um, so, I mean, that's all it's about, just getting a W, and uh, it's not really about any, any individual effort. Jay Sean, um, you look at the box score, you guys had five guys in double figures, but no one really with more than 13 points. Are you guys... How much better are you guys when it's like that as opposed to maybe one or two guys with 18 to 20? Um, I think it's, it's difficult to guard us because, you know, we we have that that team that can any any given night a guy could give you 20. So I think it's harder um, for other teams to guard us. You know, um, nobody on the team I uh, really think has hidden agendas. So nights like this, I think everybody's happy. You know, as, as long as we get the win, everybody's happy. Jay Sean, it seems like you know all year you guys have been searching to to put a game like this together. Um, even after you won on Saturday, you guys are still unhappy with with certain things. Was this the 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 complete effort that you were looking for? Is there anything you guys left out there that you're unhappy about? Um, that they out rebounded us. I think that we we could have rebounded more, but you know I think that might be our first win against a team that's higher than us in the conference standing. So um, you know we're, we're making progress. You know, like I like I said earlier, we still got more work to do. Though we can't rest on this win, um, we got four big ones coming. So, Mark, like I know, Jay Sean mentioned, they like to shoot a lot of threes. Uh, I think this was their worst three point night of the season. What? How were you guys able to be effective against them defensively? Did you feel you guys to be, were able to take some things away from them, or what? What was the difference there? Um, just making every shot as tough as possible. Um, I mean, they can't make every contested shot. 
um, just doing our best to be able uh, to trail screens and uh, making sure we head screens enough to be able to be in the gaps to where uh, if we do put pressure on the ball, they're not, a, they're not able to just blow by us.